Before we get started, make sure you subscribe to the channel. And if you're on YouTube, click the alert notification. A core concept and something that we use almost daily in our drills and our breakdowns, a lot of times we'll do this in, in post guard situations too, is to, to drill each of those main components of the dribble drive to get that element in. So right now we're going to practice those in our two-man drills. And the first two-man drill that we're going to work on right now is working on our kickups. So once again with our kickup, we want our guy in our slot, we want our guy in our deep corner. Our attack guy is going to attack the rim. He's going to get as far as he can. We're going to try to get that positive pass with the right hand. You can see Hunter sprinted up. He's getting downhill with his shoulders. And he's going to go in and rack it. He's going to get all the way to the rim. We want two foot layups all the time. All right, the more we can practice being in a position of strength in our drills and having good fundamental uh, usage, um, at all times, the better off we're going to be. And one of our things that we stress a lot is going off two feet. We want to get to the rim, we want to get in, in a position of power, and we also want to get there and get to the free throw line. We're more apt to get that call if we're off two feet. Now, the other element we add with this drill is you can have a coach. We have a, a coach here today. Uh, you can have a player, you can have a manager, anything like that. We're also going to maximize this and, and make sure that we're getting our guy that attacked. One of our principles is to get out and create space right away. So this is going to train our attack guy, which is Trey right here, to get out right away, but we're going to get him a shot in the corner too. So it's going to be a two-foot finish, power finish, and we're going to get a three-point shot, getting your weight back forward, feet and hands ready to go, and then we're going to reset. All right, here we go, guys. Let's go hard, wait for the action to get triggered. Here we go. Good. Get downhill. Two foot. There you go. Good shot. Way to knock it down. Hustle. Get, get the ball. Get ready to go. Back to coach. Here we go. Trigger it. You got to come to that stop, Aaron. Make sure you're coming to that jump stop. All right. Don't run through and get a charge. Right back. Hit that gap, Kale. There you go. Downhill. Positive pass. Get out quick. Get the weight forward. Feet and hands ready to go. Okay. Now time. Now we should have no hesitation. All right. So as we get downhill with this drill, remember, I'm in attack mode. So I'm trying to get to the rack. I'm getting stopped. I'm coming down with a, with a two foot jump stop. I'm going to kick with my right hand and immediately as that ball's in flight, I got to sprint. I have to sprint out, get here, get my weight moving forward and get ready to shoot. Downhill. Good. Get a little further. That was a negative pass. Make sure we're getting positive passes. Good. Good stroke. Here we go, Hunter and Trey. Downhill hard, positive pass, rack it, knock that down. There you go, that's a good shot. Good. Here we go, Hunter. Here we go, Dallas. There we go. Go, Aaron. Off two foot, two feet. Good job. Right on. One more. Here we go, Denholm, once we get reset. Let's go, Owen. Hit that gap hard. Go. Positive pass, downhill, get out, ready to shoot. All right, our next two-man action is going to be our kickback that we covered earlier. So our kickback is going to be initiated from a guard-to-guard -guard set here. Um, we are, once again, we're working on our dribble-drive element of our hybrid attack motion offense. And so once again, Tanner's got the ball. His mentality is to get as deep as he can. We want to get it to the rim. We don't need to, we don't want to get into the mentality that I'm driving in order to do a kickback. That's not the mentality we want. We want the mentality to be, I'm getting to the rim. If I get stopped with help, or, or my guy even gets in front, now we have our options. You know, we'll build in all the other options, but right now we're working on the kickback. So what we want to see is that attack. We want to get to the middle. We want to see that even or positive pass. He's waiting, still passing with the outside. We're going to attack downhill, get that two foot finish off that, and then we're going to get a shot at the top. Same thing. All right, guys, here we go. Tack hard, Tanner. Come behind, Hunter. Good, positive pass. Gets right back out and shot. There we go. Get reset. Pass it out quick. Here we go.
There you go. Get out quick. Go in attack mode. Here you go, Dallas. Attack. Good. There you go. Good two foot finish. Good shot. Good shot. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Now we got to stay wide. Now this is a tendency too that'll happen. You can see our spacing is starting to get poor over here on this side of the floor. This line's starting to drip. So where do we need to be, guys? We want to be, and we, we covered it earlier, we want to be slightly behind the ball. So we want you back here. Right now I'd be behind this gray line. I'd be in a trail position. And we want to be in this opposite slot because now we're encroaching on our wing, our window guy. All right, so move it over. Okay, we want you in the slot off the lane line. Who's next? You next, Andy? Okay, so we want you slightly behind. And so get, keeping you slightly behind and space correctly is going to allow for the gap that we want. If we get too flat here, and we start drifting like we just did in this drill, now I can't get that six to eight feet, foot gap and I do not have a good angle to get downhill. Now my angle is side to side and that's not triggering what we want, all right? So here we go, let's go. Coming in, good, positive pass, get downhill, Andy. Good, two foot jump stop. We got the shot, get those feet and hands ready to go. All right, ball's back, attack. Good, probably a little, a little more of a gap there, guys. Go, Carter. There you go, tack hard, get downhill, off two feet, right back. There you go, very good, very good. Get downhill, good, tacking downhill, very good, Dallas, get downhill. Owen, way to get your feet set, that's good, good. Good, you can see we're starting to build a lot of downhill attack mentality. From the top is a great place to attack the floor. Good. Attack now hard, Kate. There you go, attack. Good job. Make sure we, we get behind the line too. We don't want those long twos. So the next element of our of our two-man drills is going to be our, our back door. And so it's going to be initiated once again in the same positions on the strong side of the floor. We've got Trey in the slot, we've got Hunter deep in the corner, and we're going to work, use this on an overplay and, and later on in the video that'll trigger our baseline action that we'll talk about a little bit more in depth. So we're going to attack hard, nothing changes. So our guy in the slot here is in attack mode. We are pretending and simulating that now Hunter's guy is losing sight or helping up out of the corner. We're going to read that. We're going to call ball and we're going to back door hard. So we want to sell these things, guys, and we need to work on these elements once again, working on our fundamentals. We want to call ball and show hands, and then we want to cut hard back door, and we want to finish with a power layup, okay? So we'll get the layup, we'll vacate out again, we'll get the shot from coach out there. All right, ready to go? Here we go. You will still get a shot from coach, yep, so you'll vacate out. Here we go. There you go, good job, good job. Go hard, good. Make sure we show hands, call the ball. Here we go. Show hands, call the ball off two feet still, guys. Off two feet. Good. Dribble, call ball, a little bounce pass. Good, go hard. There's a good back door. Right back out, feet and hands ready. There we go. Hit that gap. Good, don't come too early. Way to go off two feet, Carter. It's a good job. Good, way to call for it. Good, Cade. Go up, finish strong. If you can flush it and go up and dunk it, go up and dunk it. And I want you to go hard off the rim, off the floor. 